Hi, I'm over the OC and camera. We are back to the channel with another one. This time, this time, this time. One of my favorite artists ever. Did he just say ever? Ever. Stand up, Toronto's very own Mr. Beanhead. Mr. Receding Hairline, as some like to say. I don't give a fuck what y'all like to say. I like to call him as one of the greatest artists ever. I'm king at backhanded compliments. I ain't even mean that. I was trying to give Tory Lane some compliments. I just thought about like, damn, where you going with this? You kind of you started off in the wrong foot. Long story short, I was trying to make it a Tory Lanez, one of my favorite artists ever. I ain't mean to come at the nigga's hairline or all the other shit. Five foot three, standing at about 102 pounds, soaking wet. Tory Lanez. <laughs> I wasn't trying to do that. One of my favorite artists ever, ever, ever. Tory Lanez, Tory Lanez, stand up. Oh my God, we can't wait for that new 80s project. We can't wait for that new 80s project. I gotta stop saying we. I can't wait for that new 80s project. I cannot wait for that project. Today, he blessed us on a beautiful Monday, November 15th with a new video off the news first i believe it's the first track off the new album lady of namek this shit sound like my vibe you yeah? all i heard was lady and i was like <laughs> what, we, what, what we getting into what we getting into hold on hold on, hold on. i'm here i'm here what's good what's good i'm here <laughs> Nigga Tory Lanez, man, I can't wait to see this. He's been walking around with the Jerry Curl for the last couple of months promoting this album. This album got to be hard because he's been in costume like when The Weeknd was in the red suit. Remember when The Weeknd was running around with the red suit everywhere in the broken nose? I'm like, damn, nigga, your nose hasn't healed in six months? That's how Tory Lanez is. Tory Lanez still been in this fucking Teen Wolf costume for the last three months. This album better be fire. Once again, it's La Flames, Tory Lanez. I don't really think he's going to miss. Even though I wasn't the biggest fan of Playboy but we're not here for that. Just did the Polo G video, then I saw Lady of Namek drop three hours ago. What time is it? It's 4.46, like at one o'clock. Lady of Namek dropped. I was like, nah, hold on. Hold on, now I gotta go back. I was about to like the video, I didn't even see the shit. Off the thumbnail alone, it looks like it's Tory Lanez at his prom picture. That shit's hilarious, I'm fucking with it already. Oh yeah, the name of the album again. I forgot the name of the album real quick. The name of the 80s project is gonna be Alone at Prom. That shit sounds miserable. But I know that that hurt in that nigga's chest alone at prom's gonna be fire. Nobody ever wanna hear, nobody ever wanna hear a happy rap. You wanna hear somebody sad, that's just, it's just terrible. Not even really when it comes to rap, when it comes to singing. That pain in your chest gives you different balls. Ain't nobody wanna hear prom king and queen EP. Like nobody wants to hear that, nobody wants to hear that. We barely even like happy couples. We barely even like happy couples. Nobody wanna hear that shit. Passing notes in class. How'd I already start off with this? We eight seconds in, and I'm already happy. My heart rate has already raised about five BPMs. Like, I am happy. I'm already about to go listen to this in the car and smoke. Shorty look bad as shit, too. A little tattoos. I'm a, you know, I like my little hipsters. I like my little hipsters that shower, though. I need a hipster that showers. And you know, watch that poom poom if you're fucking with me, but still be a little hipster. I like some bitch with dirty vans, but not no dirty poom poom. She got the finger waves in the head. I'm fucking with it. I'm fucking with it, yeah. Damn, don't tell me he gave her his face like she didn't check the right box. You know, he's like, do you like me, yes or no? She ain't like she checked the right box. No way a nigga with that hair is taking my bitch. And I got the fly Jerry Curl. Like, I had the fly Jerry Curl in 2010. My hair was like how Tory Lanez is in this video in 2010. I need to find some old videos of me. 2009, 2010, I was walking around like Easy e I was walking around like Easy e Tory Lanez at prom at night. Yo, the beat to this shit though is tough, I'm not gonna hold you. And I like the vibe. It's like a pan. I'm fucking with this. Also, my favorite era of movies is 1980s, so this already giving me a little movie vibe. I love the 80s, I love the 80s. Hey, he got the niggas with him and shit. Gang banging in the high school. Yeah, I like that energy, Tori. That's a thumbnail right there. Look at that fucking face. Look at the face. This thing is adorable. Look at the face. Nah, that's a fire ad. I like that. That's a, that's a thumbnail for the video I was telling y'all. The yearbook picture. How Tori Lane got a varsity jacket in high school, but I don't think he's part of the sports team. Yo, Shorty look good. Like, I'm forgetting this shit is a movie. Like, I'm forgetting it's a music video. Yeah, man, that Napoleon Dynamite feel. Okay. Now, this is fucking smacker right here. 
and I love the video. It's giving me the giggles. <laughs> pause. I feel like I gotta say pause after saying the word the giggles. Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm over here laughing. My nigga hit shorty like LaDamian Thomas and he ran the right the fuck over. Oh no, that was the nigga with the bad hair dude. He ran him over like a little dude. Bomb. Oh, he snuffed him. Yo, Tori's infamous for that. He hit a nigga like that as, at, at, at Live in Miami as well. I've seen the footage. The nigga from Love and Hip Hop, he punched him just like that. Hey, boom. Nah, fuck out of here, bro. Tori Lane. And he got the bloods on the stage with him. It's a spooky season. You better relax. Oh, he about to catch the L's, though. Yeah, you know, Tori was gangbanging. Can we play with the stars tonight? No, this shit's a smacker. I'm not gonna hold it. This is a smacker, bro. This is why I be saying this is one of the best generations of music. I don't care what y'all tell me, old heads. I don't care what y'all tell me. We could do it all. Like, like my nigga Tentacion said, R.I.P. I sing, I rap, I make rock music. I could do it all. This would have dropped in 1980. My dad would have been getting some pussy to this back in the 80s. Oh, they doing the West Side. Oh, nah, 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 nah. Y'all remember the West Side Stories? Ah, uh, nah, this is fire. Like the bodies in the West Side Story. Which I never understood about this game. Why don't you just cut the niggas arm? Because y'all both hold them. I'm gonna slice that nigga's wrist, nigga. Now you dying if we win or lose this game, bitch. You not making it out of here either way. I'm gonna just walk around with a dead arm attached to me. I'm walk around with a dead arm attached to me. I'm slicing this nigga's wrist while he's doing all this moving back. Ha ha! Ha! His arm is still out. You don't see his arm? Hey! Whoa! Ha! The game's done. That's it. Finito! Finito! This nigga be trying to poke my face. I'm slashing this nigga's wrist. The game is over. It's over, buddy. And a white boy stole this nigga's jaw. Now I'm really smoking somebody. I'm really, oh, and he poked him, and he poked him, that's why I be trying to tell y'all, stay strong, G, stay strong, keep your eye on the goal, don't keep your eye on these hoes, man, they poked my nigga Tory, nah, that's crazy, I would have to smoke somebody over long, they killed him on the first track, he died, or he better survive this, Mid Jordan, that's the dude that's always be taking his pictures and shit, I actually follow him on Instagram, if you're a Tory Lanez fan, he takes fire, fire, fire pictures of Tori. Mostly the ones that Tori uploads is from him, and he just adds the ones that Tori didn't upload. Bro, I loved it. Edited by Tori Lanes, as you guys already know. Now it's already a little mainstream. We all know this, but Tori edits his videos. I've been trying to tell you guys for a while, from one guy editing videos to the next. His videos are a lot more work to edit as well. But bro, there's a lot of artists that don't even don't even fuck fuck editing their videos. They're not even writing their bars. So imagine editing their music, having put into the direction of where the video is going, help working with the directors, getting your vision out there. Like, bro, it's not artists doing that shit. That's why I love people like Tory Lanez. I love people like Tentacion. I love St. John. I love Kid Cudi, Kanye West. The thing about these real, real, real creative dudes is like, bro, this is once in a generation. This is once in a lifetime. Tory Lanez, I feel like his whole career, he'd been handed out bad cards, bro. He's so talented that irritate. I love to say this every single time. Tory Lanez, is better than your favorite artist. Whatever you like to say, you can say yes, you can say no, you can argue me to death. I'm not gonna reply, it's fine. I'll leave your comment, comment down below like, no, fuck out of here. Little Skies is way better than Tory Lanez. Okay, you can think that white boy, you can think that. But music wise, music wise, what the kid does, Tory Lanez can sing, rap. And I know you guys are like, a lot of people can sing and rap, but not to his stature. They can't rap like him. They can't sing like him. We already seen what he did to Joyner Lucas. I'm mad Joyner Lucas is from up the block. He keeps rapping Worcester like, nigga, stop telling niggas that. Stop telling niggas that, because now you got us looking bad. You got murdered by the nigga from the 6th. You kept calling him a singer. You kept calling him a singer and saying he don't want to rap with you. Look what happened when he rapped with you. Don Q, the little Goompa nigga from fucking Super Mario Brothers from High Bridge, he's another one that got stepped on. Tory Lane should have been Mario for Halloween the way he stepped on these little niggas, bro. It was bad. It was bad. But Tory Lanez, I love, love, love him as an artist. He will forever be one of my favorite artists ever. Guys, comment down below. Are you as excited as I am for Alone at Prom? Are you looking forward to that album as much as I am? I can't wait. Oh, it's going to be the perfect winter music. It's going to be the perfect winter music. I can't wait. Also, let's make sure we drop a like. I dropped a like 15,000. 
Alone at Prom will be the best vibe setting album ever, ever. Say goodbye to Netflix and chill. Say hello to Tory Lane. I'm telling you, you throw this on, you automatically gonna start hearing like, yo, did I leave the faucet open? Did you use the bathroom? Did you leave the water faucet open? You hear that shit? She's like, no. That's just my vagina getting wet. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. You're going to have one of those. Oh, Lord. I'm telling you, you're going to have a water faucet in your room. Have some extra sheets around. If you ever fucked a chubby bitch before, you know what it is. If you ever fucked a chubby bitch before, you know what it is. Comment down below. And before I leave you guys alone, let me make sure I make sure I make sure I make sure I remind you guys we're on the road to 1,000. We are so close. We are at 898. Oh, my God. I can taste it. Oh, my God. I can taste it. 102 more. Do your due diligence. And please subscribe down to the channel below. Make sure you hit up the notifications. Why? Because I drop videos almost every single day. Drop a like. Hey, while you're there, might as well click it, huh? <laughs> Take a little smile on this guy's face. Look at that. Don't you like to see that? Don't you like to see that? Don't you like to see that? Make sure you subscribe down below and select the next one. Like I love to say, until the next one, we out of here.